coaches, how do you price your coaching so that you can make sure that you both feel confident when you're selling it and that people will actually buy it? I've been helping coaches for the last 21 years scale their businesses, and I want to show you the best way to confidently price your business so that people actually buy it from you, so that you feel good about it and people love it. For those of you that I haven't met yet, my name is Jeremiah Krakowski, and for the last 21 years, I've been building coaching and course businesses in the online space. Back then, they were CD and DVD products. I built multiple businesses over the $10 million a year mark, and I want to help you reach your goals with your coaching and course business. Now, pricing is an area where a lot of people, there's a lot of different information out there, but one of the things you gotta do is you have to detach your self-worth from what you're charging. And you need to start charging for the result that you deliver. Now you might be saying, I'm a life coach, I'm a spiritual coach, how do I do that? That's easy for you, Jeremiah, you sell an ROI, stuff like that. Let me explain, okay? If you can take the experience the transformation that you bring in people's lives and then you extrapolate it out. What that means is you take the timeline, here's today, and then here's where they are next week. And then where are they next year? And then where are they at two years from now? When you extend that out, you can see that the one transformation of working with you produced a ripple effect in their life of results. I remember my first mentor that I ever met changed my family's future. In fact, it generated hundreds of millions of dollars in potential profit. Sadly, a number of different situations, things like that, didn't produce that much, but it did generate close to $100 million over the years for my mom, as well as combined with myself and my business, as well as the ripple effect of the lives that we've impacted during that time. And so all of that to say, this one mentor, which then we met another mentor and another mentor. And by the way, I believe in people having mentors for seasons, not like one mentor forever. But I do find a lot of the clients that work with me, they stay for a while and I work with them long term uh, to help them get results. All that to say that if you are a coach or mentor, that you got to look at what is the long term value of somebody working with you? What is the return on investment that they're going to get. And, and think about this too. What is the cost of inaction that they can lose by not working with you? I'll tell you this, people who don't work with me, the economy, inflation starts to go up. I have people who I literally have been saying, oh yeah, Jeremiah, I'll work with you. I'll work with you eventually, eventually, eventually. They've been saying it for four years and they are not in a better position today by making excuses. I have other clients that are literally have that like gone from zero when I started working with them five years ago and today they're over the $10 million a year mark in their business. So it's like, that's the, that's literally the cost of inaction when somebody hears me and I teach and they don't do anything with what I'm saying. And, and that's, and that I'm, I'm going to level with you is true. It's a hundred percent true is that if you do listen and apply, if you subscribe to my YouTube channel and you watch the different content that I have, if you watch the different trainings that I have, and you're able to join my coaching program, you'll get results if you apply the information, if you start to do it. And that's what I'd love to help you with as well. The biggest area I find that a lot of people get stuck in is understanding their value. So well, the other thing we gotta think about is this, is that pricing is a form of boundaries. As coaches, we need to have boundaries. We want people to use us for their benefit. You know, I, like I desire for you to use me and my information to make a ton of money. That would be the wisest thing that you could do. <coughs> Excuse me, a little bit of a cough here. But I cannot attach the need for you to use what I'm going to do to my self-worth and how much I'm going to price things to where I make it so cheap that you don't do anything because I am just wanting to make sure that you you work with me at all costs. Like, I, I used to be this way. Coaches, get we get desperate. We want people to work with us. We want people to become our clients. We want people to use 
what we teach that we end up undercutting, underpricing ourselves just to get a client as far as that goes. I was guilty of this for years. Now I refuse to. There's a bare minimum cost of working with me. You got, I got my free content that's out there for the people who can't afford it. And, and the ones who know that they are supposed to work with me to get the results, they jump in and they become a client. We have an incredible time together producing results. Like my client, Kim, when she came in and was able to make six figures with her real estate offer in a down market or like Ian, who was able to make over $40,000 a month in his business after applying this information. When I met him, he was like, I don't know how to make this work. I don't know if I could make this work. And I'm like, no, literally you just do this stuff and it works. And so when you price your business, you gotta establish yourself as an authority. The value that of how you see yourself is the way that others will see you. And so people won't respect you or your time or your value if you don't respect you, your time or your value. And you got to start seeing yourself as far more valuable internally. It starts with the self-belief. It starts with the mindset. It starts with seeing your value as greater than just people using you for their benefit, but rather that you are worth people paying a significant amount for. Now, on the return on the investment side of things, pricing yourself in at about 5 to 10% of whatever that return on investment is. Generally, I like to do about 10%. Most of the clients who come in and work with me the minimum potential that they'll end up making is about twenty to forty thousand dollars a month in their business. We'll help them get to their first ten thousand. A lot of people actually shoot right past that and make about twenty thousand dollars a month consistently, not just one time, but consistently in their business when they start to do the work, when they start to apply it. And so, if I price my program at ten percent of that, it comes in right around two thousand dollars as far as that goes. And, and, and again, that's not per month, but I'm, that's like a one-time fee as far as that goes. And that's very affordable. That's very doable for people. We have payment plans on that as well that people can do. $200 a month. We have free trials that people can take. 14-day test drive to try it out. We give you free courses just for trying it out. It's, a, it's an incredible deal. Honestly, most coaches don't offer that much but I believe in our system so much that I know that it gets people results, that if they can get in there and they can get immersed in what we're doing, they will see the difference that it makes by working with the best program that's out there. And I believe we have what, like, not just one of the best programs, but that we have literally in like the top tier of best programs. And we've had people that have been in multiple coaching programs. They've spent 10 times what we charge for our program. And they tell me consistently, Jeremiah, your program is better than those ones that I spent 10 times as much for. I hear this all the time. I'm not saying this to brag, but I'm saying this, that when you can create something of value, you can start to feel confident in what you price it for. And you can actually decide what type of client that you want to work with. I love working with the person that is at the place where you are, where you're trying to figure out your pricing where you're trying to figure out how do I want to package things? How do I want to put these things together? And then how do I start marketing these things? And how do I then start actually getting clients and doing so in a 30 to 60 day time period? Not a lot of time. Not a lot of time spent dilly-dallying around or wasting time, but actually taking action and getting results. And that's the kind of things that we see with our clients when they go through our program. So when when you price your program out, You want to think about, A, who is the type of person that I want to attract to me? And your messaging also does correlate to this pricing. If you're charging $10,000, $20,000, $30,000, that's a higher level of person who's looking for a higher level of result. They're looking for at least 10 times, 20 times that result. They're looking to make, when they work with me, at least $200 to $500 to $1 million dollars when they pay for a higher level like that. I have a $19,000 one-on-one program that people can work with me in. And and in that $19,000 program, that's exactly the investment that people make to be able to get that one-on-one immediate access on the things that they're looking for. 
And so we got these two tiers that I offer. That's what I, I say. A lot of people have two tiers. Have your one-on-one -on -one offering being the highest level, being something that people can work for. Offer a payment plan on that. $19,000 can come out right about $1,600 a month, which for a lot of people is actually decently affordable for most people when they're really looking to produce a result. $1,600 a month is a great price point, I think, to reach people as far as that goes. Okay, and then you know, two to three hundred dollars a month for something that's really delivering value in a group setting, one on one group setting. And then, what you can do with this is you can generate a real business that's making three hundred, four hundred, five hundred thousand dollars a year without having to work more than 10 to 15 hours a week. That's the kind of business that we've been able to build for ourselves. We were able to build a seven figure business. That's over a million dollars in working just 10 to 15 hours a week by positioning ourselves the right way, by creating the right type of content that attracts the right people to us, that connects with the right kind of people, and that allows us to truly reach the people that we're meant to work with and serve them at a very high level. And, and we have the lowest amount of chargebacks completely like no complaints from people. People absolutely love it. And it's because we've positioned it in the right way. We've made sure that our messaging is aligned in the right way. And we've priced it in a way where we're not the cheapest option. Listen, don't be the cheapest option. You don't want to be the cheapy person that's out there. You want to be the one that you know you're worth and you can feel very confident about what you're pricing it in at. I recommend for a lot of people, if you're marketing online, no less than $500 for what you're offering. And if you do a payment plan on that, you know, you could do a six payments of 97 bucks. Super affordable for people as far as that goes. You could even offer a 12 pay of $47 as far as that goes. Again, it's a little bit more expensive on the payment plan. They can, they can save 100 bucks, $500 if they don't do payments. I've known a lot of people they've actually generated. I have a client right now who's does about sixty to eighty thousand dollars per month, and he just sells a, a course every six weeks for five hundred dollars. That's it. Or does a three pay option on it for about a hundred and I think like two hundred dollars a payment is what it is for three payments, and and he's making that much consistently a month in his business. They, he spends right around maybe 10,000 on ads and generates about 50,000 in, in, in profit on the low end in his business, cash received by doing this, by following this model, by pricing things at that level. If you're, if you're cheaper than, and I wanna talk about the different levels of pricing, if you're cheaper than $97, I consider that just to be a sales and marketing um, tool. It's not something that delivers transformation. It's something that provides value, but it's not gonna be the whole system. Like for instance, this video right here, I, I know that I'm providing tremendous value in this video already. You've watched this. And if I've left some value for you, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to see that just to encourage people. It also helps the algorithm boost some of these different videos. <laughs> if, you, if you share in the comments like that, would love that and would, would appreciate it. Any questions you have for me, please share that as far as that goes too. But in this, that when we give value, there's a difference between like a, a free piece of content like this and my whole coaching program. I have discovered what are the strategic messages that people want and they're looking for in my free content that I deliver, and then what do I actually charge for? We've actually surveyed people. I have a document that has nearly 200 pages on it, 200 pages just of surveys of people that we've worked with over the last two years of what are they looking for, and pricing comes up all the time on that. And so that's an initial question that people always ask me when working with me. So what I do is I, I if something's priced under $97, I'm going to deliver value on these entry level questions and concerns and issues that people have as they're coming through the door. Then what ends up happening is, is I have a group of people when they come into my coaching program, they start to discover certain areas where they're struggling with. And I don't teach on that stuff as much 
outside of my coaching program. Like I'm actually, I'm actually starting to shift my coaching program to even adjust for where I'm seeing the most transformation delivered with my clients, which was completely different than what I expected for years. Um, I found that if I actually give the strategies away for free, that people often are coming to me to figure out how to actually implement it and really work through what are those blocks that are stopping them from implementing because they know the strategies. I give a lot of them away for free. If you're looking for the strategy, it's not rocket science. I walk you through it in my coaching program as well. Very simple, very easy to follow. We show you how to find the right prospects, how to promote your business in the right way, and then how to, the most important part, close sales, which is why it produces so much revenue and cash flow for our clients. And then what are the things that you run into along the way, the pitfalls, so that I can be the one to help guide and direct you and, and help move you past some of the different hurdles and struggles that you might have along the way. And that's exactly what, what I work with people with every single week in our programs. And so in that, that's where people make that investment with me. But if I'm charging under $97, and by the way, one of my favorite price points to do, $7, $17, $27. Just depends on how much value is delivered. But I love stuff for like $7 to $17 because it's so cheap that almost anybody's going to say yes to it. But it's enough that if somebody's not really serious, they're not even going to pay attention to it. And that's why I like the seven to seventeen dollar price point so much on delivering value. Maybe I'll I'll put like a mini course out there, or like a like a three module like micro course that's an introductory to people on what to take. And then the goal of that is to move people along a path to where they're able to see the value and they're able to make a decision that says, Okay, I like Jeremiah, he's awesome, I wanna work with him further and jump into his, his program. And, and that's where then people can, can try out our program, can, can test drive it, can see under the hood as far as the value that we deliver, how it's, how it's truly better than anything else that's out there that's delivered by other people. And again, I'd love to, I'd love to work with you through that. I'd love to show you some of that as well inside of our program uh, if, you, if you're able to jump into that. I, I, I truly, truly believe that it's one of the best programs on the planet for this type of stuff. Okay, so when you're pricing your stuff out, anything that's under $97 is for marketing purposes. It's for building that trust with people. Okay, also depending on what you're selling on the back end, if I was selling something for maybe $20,000 as my main product, I might charge a little bit more, like $200 or $300 as the entry level, as far as that goes. Okay, but you don't, you're not going to make a profit on some on $97 sessions, on $200 sessions. Your profit margins are gonna come on things that are over $500, $1,000 and up. And when you can truly deliver value to people, if you're delivering at least $5,000 worth of value to people, they'll pay you 500 bucks. If you're delivering at least $10,000 worth of value to people, they'll pay you $1,000 because they're paying you $1 and getting 10 back in value. And, it's, and it really is a small fee for what they're really getting on the back end of that. And so when you can work on A, how you think about yourself, the value that you're delivering to people, and you're no longer caught up in the, oh, am I, am I worth it? it? You know, is this, am I doing the right thing? Uh, am I, are people going to actually see my value? Are they actually going to pay this for me? And you start to say, you know what? I believe in what I'm worth. And I believe in what my time is worth. And I'm worth it for the right people to come in, not just anybody to work with me. You can start to position yourself as that authority to the right people who will start to recognize and see your value. And then they will start to come in and they'll be like, wow, they'll see the difference of working with you because they will be served at such a high level. One of the best ways, again, to do this is you can create pieces of content. You can create low-cost offers that are, that are not intended for profit margin, but for building trust and nurturing that relationship. And then you can make calls to action to higher-priced offers, things that are $500,000, $2,000, $10,000, $20,000. And by the way, I believe anybody watching this right now, you can 
sell, you can package an offer of your services that's worth $20,000. You might be saying, gosh, what could I package for $20,000? I, I had a health coach once who we helped her with this. It included like a year's worth of health coaching, uh, lab testing, all the supplements, things like that. Sure, yes, did it cost her a, a couple grand per client to deliver some of that? It did. There was a little bit of some give and take on that. But she was able to price it in such a way that her margins were so significant that her business, her name was Dawn, she was able to make over $35,000 a month by working with us and putting this together and really structuring an offer that people really, really want, really loved and, and really enjoyed doing and finding. So the way that we find our clients is through content, social media, organic as well as paid advertising. We are able to use the algorithms to our advantage to draw people in. And that's what I work with people through in my coaching program to know what is the right topics to talk about? What's the right messaging? How do we sell it? How do we promote it? How do we put it all together so that they can start to have consistent profits, clarity in what they're doing, and they know exactly what the right things to do are and the right words to say to close the sale. And that starts to create the real financial freedom and time freedom in their life. Because I don't want to see you burnt out. I don't want to see you working more than 10 to 15 hours a week. And I know that if you can really start to apply yourself with this stuff and you actually start to go to work and you actually work with somebody like myself to produce those results, you'll start to get them. And so listen, I'd love to see you in my program. I'd love to work with you. Subscribe to this channel. Keep watching all the different videos that we put out there. I promise you we will serve you at the highest level here on this YouTube channel, as well as on my Instagram and Facebook. You can go check those out as well. We'll talk soon. Have a good one, everybody.